We at Concord Materials seek to become a SaaS-enabled B2B marketplace with embedded fintech features for the construction industry. Our team comes from multi-generation construction families. We each grew up working in the sector and learned the industry from the field up. Anthony, a full-stack developer, successfully founded, built, scaled to multi-million in ARR, and sold to a publicly traded company an enterprise concrete software platform. Anthony is chiefly responsible for product development and strategy. I am a former construction and financial services professional who managed over 700 employees and $250 million in P&L for the second largest specialty contractor in North America. I also directed all the company's technology initiatives. I am chiefly responsible for business development and operations. Both of us experience the problems Concrete Materials seeks to solve on a daily basis. Placing orders over the phone creates errors and disagreements between parties. Paper tickets, which are frequently lost and damaged, lack real proof of delivery. Reconciliation is a costly manual process. These transactions are also plagued by contract terms, which are often violated, early pay discounts, which are not captured, and interest income that is left uncollected. SMEs also pay 20% more for, the, for these bulk materials compared to large operators, even when they pay for the materials quicker. Over 87,000 North American construction firms purchase sand, stone, and cement each day. These aggregate consumers consist of four stakeholders, ready-mix operators, precast manufacturers, asphalt producers, and contractors. Concord Materials' current focus is ready-mix operators, but we expect to target the three other stakeholders in the near future. These companies spend over $60 billion annually on these three materials alone. The SaaS, logistics, fintech, and marketplace opportunity is over $3 billion. This also does not take into account adjacent industries, such as steel, lumber, rebar, or glass, with similar issues, which raises the total market opportunity to over $150 billion. The core catalyst for change is the generational labor shortage across all functions of construction firms. This labor problem has escalated the need for technology adoption. We at Concord seek to build an end-to-end -end solution for our customers. To accomplish this objective, we are taking a three-phased approach. De-risk the transaction, finance the transaction, and facilitate the transaction. We've started with de-risking the transaction. This enables us to gain valuable insights into customer networks, localized pricing, and cash management processes for these localized operators. With this knowledge, we hope to better underwrite these transactions to provide an accurate an appropriate financial product for construction operators. And finally, we hope to facilitate the transaction for our customers. To date, we have built the central ordering hub and digital ticket features of our platform. We are also in the final stages of building the OCR reconciliation product. Our product results in immediate and significant cost savings, specifically on labor hours allocated to manual reconciliation for our customers. By digitizing the workflow, we allow invoices to be approved within hours instead of weeks. While our solution results in immediate cost savings, in order to drive faster adoption, we've intentionally priced our SaaS product to be inexpensive for customers so that we can secure the data for underwriting each transaction and scale order volume to secure improved pricing from suppliers. Concord would collect monthly SaaS fees in addition to a 7% take rate on transactions with high AOV and daily reoccurrence, making LTL, LTV per customer very attractive. We are currently helping four Massachusetts-based operators, including the largest independent ready-mix operator in New England, streamline their processes. Our current customer backlog in these markets is strong and it's growing weekly. Our strategy is to build density in Boston and then migrate down the I-95 corridor to New York and Philadelphia. Our phased strategy to expand across geographies and customer segments incorporates regional network effects to drive adoption and build a valuable moat. This spring, we seek to raise $3 million of capital to build out our team. Thank you very much for viewing this presentation. Please do not hesitate to reach out with any additional questions.